a new home. Unit 3, Section 3. The name of the poem is Retired. First, I will read the poem once. Please listen carefully. He was tired after his voyages. The shuttles from planet to planet, from star to star. In the late evening, he would sway in his rocking chair and watch the moon through the trees. I was there once, he thought. I stood on that globe. Now it is like a football shining in space. And he could hardly believe it that in his helmet and in his bulky space suit, he had stirred that far dust. The poem is written by Ian Cryden Smith, a Scottish writer, poet and a novelist who has written many novels and poems. So the poetry is about a person who is retired from his voyages. Retired means a person who has left his job typically after reaching a normal age for leaving services. So he is a retired person who remembers his journeys through space. He was once an astronaut who had traveled from planet to planet and star to star on his space journeys. So in this poem, the poet describes about an astronaut who has completed his voyages. The speaker in this poem has a feeling of nostalgia. What do you mean by nostalgia? It is a feeling, a desire to return in thoughts to a former time in one's life, the feeling of sadness mixed with pleasure and affection when we think of the happy moments or times in the past. It is a bit bittersweet inner feeling towards things, people and places in the past. So he is feeling and experiencing happiness when he thinks of a former place or situation which he had gone through in the past. So children, now let's begin with the explanation and understanding of the poem. Retired He was tired after his voyages, the shuttles from planet to planet, from star to star. So here, the astronaut is retired after he had completed his voyages, which were long journeys, which involved space travel from planet to planet and from star to star. He traveled far and wide in space, that is in his spacecraft. He traveled far and wide in his spacecraft. From planet to planet and from star to star he traveled. The second paragraph. In the late evening he would sway in his rocking chair and watch the moon through the trees. So one fine day he sat on his swaying chair, that is rocking chair. Sway here means the movement to and fro, that is backward and forward direction. Swing, swinging, he was, he was sitting in his rocking chair. After he retired, one late evening, he was swaying in his rocking chair and saw the moon through the trees and remembered his voyages and the time he spent in space. So here in this paragraph, the poet is telling us, that the speaker on one late evening he was swaying on his chair and remembering about his past he is remembering his voyages the next paragraph i was there once he thought i stood on that globe now it is like a football shining in space i was there once where he was on the moon once he says he thinks about it that there I was once, I stood on that globe. So here, now it is like a football shining in space. So here, these uh, sentences are referring to the moon and he says that he had been to that place once as he is remembering of, of his voyages and the time he has spent uh, in space in his voyages. So he says to the moon that it is like a football now shining in space. He was there once on the moon. He could hardly believe the times of his past. 
that in his bulky space suit that by wearing the helmet of his bulky space suit he had once walked on the moon he could hardly believe the time that he spent in space by wearing the helmet of his bulky space suit bulky which means heavy and he says that once i had walked on the moon and he had disturbed the dust on the moon he had stirred that far dust which means the moon dust had been disturbed when he walked on the moon heed is a contraction of the word he had so he had disturbed by walking on the moon the dust on the moon to summarize the poem it is about thoughts of the past the speaker thinks remembers about his past who is an astronaut and he was tired after his voyages tired here is retired and staying at home remembering about his past feelings of happiness with sadness mixed emotions bitter sweet inner feelings which he is having there and he is remembering about his past voyages which he had traveled in his spacecraft from planet to planet and star to star one late evening he sat on his rocking chair thinking remembering his past looking at the moon and saying that i was there once he thinks he remembers and recalls that he stood on that globe now it is like a football from far it is round in shape like a football shining in space he is referring to the moon as a football here so it is a simile comparison between the moon and the football we are compare there is a comparison done which is called as a simile so and he could hardly believe that he was wearing the helmet of his bulky space suit wearing those things he had walked once on the moon and the moon dust was dis disturbed because of his walking on the moon so he could hardly believe his space journeys recalls it and feels happy as well as sad remembering about his past journeys He's lost control. One minute and 30 seconds, and stable as a rock. Keep talking, Felix, keep talking. Three minutes free fall, three minutes free fall. Felix, you're at the coldest altitude. The further you fall, the warmer it's going to get. Keep it up. 
Felix, you were so proud of you. You did absolutely fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. I couldn't have done any better myself.